Welcome to part three of our Royal Observer Corps equipment series. Uh, this week we are looking at the piece of equipment that replaced the fixed survey meter, uh, which was used from 1958 until 19, probably around about 1983. Uh, the unit chosen was made by Plessy, and it is the PDRM82F was the designation, standing for Portable Dose Rate Meter, uh, 1982 and F is fixed. Uh, the term fixed comes from the fact that it has a coax connector at the back. Coax connector then with the cable, and then we have an external Geiger-Muller probe. Powered by three C-cell batteries, it has an LCD display. It is measured in centigrades per hour, going from zero to 300 centigrades. So obviously very, very high levels of radiation either from a nuclear attack or from a nuclear power station melting down, similar to Chernobyl, obviously. Uh, the units started to come in, as I said, in around about 1983, uh, with some posts not getting them until at least 1985. And this was the unit they used then right up until stand down in 1991 of the field force and their monitoring posts. Uh, along with this, they would have used the a telescopic rod then. And any of you have seen the, any visits to abandoned posts, uh, we'll see the sort of the rectangular hole in the desk. This is where this would have slid into. And then obviously with the coax cable and the probe with the telescopic rod, that would have gone up the FSM pipe in the roof. Uh, they didn't just have this unit. They, uh, observers for mobile monitoring, if they needed to go out and do mobile monitoring outside to see what the radiation levels were like outside, uh, they would have used this, which was the PDRM82, which is probably the most common one. You'll have seen this in quite a few YouTube videos because they still work perfectly well today. And if you are a prepper or whatever, this, you know, this is a very, very handy unit. It won't show background radiation. It won't show low check sources, but uh, you know, in, if there ever has ever a, a nuclear event, this is the sort of unit you want. Um, and they, d they do still work quite well. And you can pick these up for about 30 quid still. Uh, they didn't just make this. Obviously, I showed you they, uh, they made the, the, the Pantel unit. They made the fixed unit. There was also a PDRM82M, which was a military unit. It was green. Uh, PDRM82C, which was a hardwired unit. Um, and then they also made this, which is the PDRM82D. Uh, this is probably the first time many of you have seen this. Uh, this is a completely ruggedized unit. Again, green. This is the same green color that the 82M would have been. It has a speaker. Um, it has a remote probe as well, but it is on this length of a uh, curly cable. Uh, and this will react to check sources. So, oh, let's put this down a second, turn it on first of all. And unlike the, uh, all the other units, as you can see, this is uh, 0. 0.0000 centigrade per hour, rather than just being 0, 0.0, which the other ones are, are scaled in. So I'll get a little check source here. I'll put it on here. I'll put the uh, probe on it. So this is only gamma. Only detects gamma radiation. So there's certain spots of this that will get to 50. But uh, as you can see, um, it's just a piece of uh, pitch blend. We actually are detecting a bit of background radiation there. Or not background, check, check source radiation. So this is quite a, a handy unit that, uh, you know, you would be able to use this at Chernobyl if you were going there on a holiday. Um, in fact, I am going there in May um, on a weekend trip. So I uh, might bring this with me. I'm in two minds about it at the moment. But you know, we're up to 36 there. But yeah, that unit works very, very well. And uh, these are quite not uh, that common. Um, you don't see these too often. Um, I picked this up on eBay um, just before Christmas um, and I paid £150 for it. But, uh, you know, you'll generally pick one up for about between 150 and 200 depending on who the seller is and how many people spot it and are looking for it. But these are quite sought after and quite rare. But, uh, yeah, that is the, um, the PDRM82F. Uh, you'll get one of these probably for about between 100 and 150 uh, any day of the week on eBay. Uh, but uh, they're well worth having if you have a, an ROC post or you're collecting. These are very, very handy. And if you are a prepper, they're quite handy as well. Uh, but 
we let me see what we'll show in our next video in the next video we will show the training unit for this uh obviously you know this didn't didn't come with a, a clockwork piece of equipment to operate this that's something we've been more sophisticated but i'll show that in the next video uh that's called the radiac trainer uh and uh yeah we'll show that in the next video so uh yeah join us next week for that thanks for watching Bye bye